How to Talk to Women by Ray Asher is a manual aimed at offering men guidance on effectively communicating with women with the intention of improving their romantic and dating interactions. The book is designed to help men create an attractive impression and build intimacy through conversation, ensuring they never find themselves at a loss for words. Asher begins by underscoring the importance of confidence in communication with women. Having confidence, he suggests, is essential because it sets the tone for the interaction and makes a man more appealing. The author also advises men to work on their self-esteem and to engage in practices that boost confidence, such as adopting positive affirmations, improving body language, and focusing on strengths rather than weaknesses. The book presents conversation as an art form that can be mastered through understanding and practice. To keep a conversation flowing, Asher advises men to be well-read and informed about various subjects, suggesting that knowledge across different topics will provide a wealth of material to draw from during interactions. He also advocates for the use of humor as a means to connect, but stresses the importance of using it appropriately and not forcing it, as it has to come naturally to be effective. Listening is highlighted as a key aspect of conversation. Asher points out that being a good listener enables a man to understand a woman's perspective better, which in turn allows for deeper connections to be made. He also suggests that men should be observant and pay attention to details, which can be used to bring depth into conversations. Being attentive to what a woman says and how she says it can provide insights into her emotions and thoughts, creating a pathway for more meaningful exchanges. In terms of what to say, Asher provides practical advice on topics and question types that can open up dialogue. Open-ended questions, for instance, are recommended over yes-no questions because they give the woman an opportunity to share more about herself. The author also emphasizes the significance of being genuine in conversations, pointing out that feigned interest is usually transparent and counterproductive. The book also deals with challenging communication scenarios. Asher offers tips on how to handle awkward silences, suggesting that they can sometimes be a natural part of conversation and should not necessarily be feared. He recommends using pauses as opportunities to reflect on the conversation and to think of new topics to discuss. Additionally, Asher teaches men how to read cues that indicate a woman's interest and provides strategies for steering the conversation in directions that are more likely to pique her curiosity and engagement. Asher emphasizes the importance of building a connection gradually. He warns against rushing into personal or sensitive topics too quickly, as this can be off-putting. Instead, he suggests a more measured approach that mirrors the pace of the woman's comfort level with sharing. By doing so, a man can demonstrate respect for her boundaries and a willingness to cultivate trust. Storytelling is presented as a technique to make conversations more engaging. Asher believes that well-told stories can captivate an audience and also reveal much about the storyteller's personality and values. He encourages men to develop storytelling skills and to share anecdotes that are relevant and reveal positive traits about themselves. The author also offers advice on flirting, characterizing it as an essential component of romantic conversation. He cautions, however, that there is a fine line between playful flirting and being perceived as insincere or overly aggressive. To flirt effectively, he advises men to use subtle compliments, playful teasing, and light-hearted humor while closely monitoring the woman's reactions to ensure she is comfortable with the interaction. Asher tackles the challenge of rejection head-on, advising readers to view it not as a personal failure but as a natural part of the process of finding compatibility. He encourages men to learn from rejection by reflecting on the interaction identifying any mistakes or areas for improvement, and using that knowledge to enhance future conversations with women. The latter part of the book delves into the nuances of body language as an additional layer of conversation. Asher teaches men to decode a woman's nonverbal signals and to become more aware of their own body language. He stresses that nonverbal cues can often speak louder than words and can profoundly affect how one's words are received. Employing positive body language can significantly improve the way men are perceived during interactions. In terms of approaching women, 
Asher takes a strategic stance. He breaks down different contexts such as bars, cafes, and online platforms, providing specific advice for each setting. Regardless of the environment, the author maintains that it is important to be aware of social norms and to approach women with respect and consideration for their comfort levels. The book concludes with an emphasis on the need for practice and persistence. Asher encourages men to actively engage in conversations with women, even if it means stepping out of their comfort zones. Acknowledging that each interaction is a learning opportunity, he suggests that the more men practice, the more natural and fluid their conversations will become. Overall, How to Talk to Women by Ray Asher provides a comprehensive guide for men to improve their conversational skills with women, promoting the goal of building attraction, rapport, and potentially lasting connections. Through a blend of attitude adjustments, conversational techniques, and understanding the nuances of communication, men are equipped with the tools to engage women in conversations that are both enjoyable and held in high regard. You can listen to the full audiobook for free by following the URL in the description.